a salmon. All right. Welcome to another episode of Flying by the Seat of My Pants Cooking, brought to you by My Road to Thailand. Okay, I've got uh, brown and wild rice going in the cooker, and this is the first time I've used this rice, so I'm kind of nervous that it's not going to be the right uh, combination for this cooker. First, I'm going to cut them in pieces. There, there's the English cucumber. One teaspoon of kosher salt. And with clean hands, I'm scrunching that up. Okay, drain the water. Okay, normally on my channel I call it flying by the seat of my pants cooking mostly because I don't usually have all the ingredients for a specific recipe. This time I actually have probably everything but I purposely wanted to do this very well so I uh, made sure I had everything. So the next thing is four, four um, tablespoons of uh, rice vinegar. Actually, I had this already, and this says seasoned. The recipe I looked at said unseasoned, but I wasn't going to buy another bottle just because of the fact that this one is seasoned. So I'm going to use this one. And um, one and a half teaspoons of honey. Now I'm going to put this mixture over the cucumbers and then it's going in the refrigerator to chill while I prepare the salmon after I mix this around. I don't have a um, cast iron pan and my frying pan isn't big enough for this so I'm going to be using my George Foreman and uh, the recipe called for it to be room temperature so I'm going to put two tablespoons of uh, avocado oil in there and then I'm going to uh, put the salmon in but first I have to cut the salmon you do want to make sure you have the salmon with the skin on That's actually bigger than I thought. I didn't realize that piece was folded under. Okay, now I'm going to season my uh, filleted salmon with uh, kosher salt, just like this. Apparently salmon, according, I'm not a big fan of salt, and I don't even think I've ever had kosher salt, but apparently uh, salmon can take it. Ok, 
Okay, now they're in the uh, pan with the uh, avocado oil and the pan is cold so I'm going to turn that on to medium. I'm not using the lid, I'm just giving it six to eight minutes and then I'm going to flip them and turn the heat off. Okay, that's almost eight minutes. This is eight minute mark. Flip them over and turn the heat off and leave it on for a minute. There, you heard it. Turn the heat off. Flip them over. Gently. Okay, there's the one minute timer. I'm taking them off. The rice, oddly enough, is still not done according to the rice cooker. So I'm trusting the rice cooker because it's starting to look better, but I'm gonna just set these aside. Maybe I'll put some paper towel in here first. Or no. I don't know, I should be okay. Let's see what they look like. what it looks like. Okay, the rice is ready. Um, it's been sitting for a couple minutes. Put the scallions in here. Just so you know, I tasted the rice. It's salty. I wish I hadn't put any of that kosher salt in because the um, salmon is very salty. And I know now, because I've never had kosher salt before, I'm going to go use it very sparingly from this point on. And I see the rice is stuck to the bottom of this thing, so that's going to be fun to clean. This normally, and I did put uh, butter in here, so... It normally doesn't stick. Yep. I have to get the oxy clean out to get that out of there. Or maybe not. No, it's coming off. Oh, yeah. It's coming off. Scraping off. I don't mind crusty rice. Put the rest of these scallions in here and mix it up. Plate this dish.
I need to put a fork in this uh, video because my wife from Thailand is going to be calling soon. Okay. Let's grab a piece of this. Take a big piece. And my fridge pickles. Save that for the rest. All right, folks, the moment we've all been waiting for. Thank you, Lord, for this food. I pray that it doesn't harm me in any way, shape, or form. To the glory of your son, Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. How's that look? Probably looks okay, but, but, salty like son of a gun. I'm not using that salt anymore. Well, sparingly. So let's try this out. Get a piece of salmon. Fridge pickle. Well, rice. Okay, like I said, it's, it is over-salted, too much salt, but thankfully the uh, cucumber with the rice vinegar and the honey combination, it's taken the edge off, so it's actually not bad. So I'm going to give it a half a thumb up. Again, if you like this kind of content, uh, thumbs up. A sub to the channel would be awesome but again it's not the end of the world I have to cut this off because it's 619 and that's 619 a.m. Thailand time and that's about the time my wife calls so shortly anyway all right happy Thanksgiving everybody tomorrow's Thanksgiving in Canada actually not bad now yeah, it is salty but okay thanks again for watching I appreciate your uh, support take care God bless I'm out